1988, Bella won the popular vote of the Albany Art Competition, which carried quite a good prize at the time. It was a very nice painting, black and white, as we call nightscape painting. Public appreciated it, and uh, we were very, very happy when she won that award. I said to her, Bella, this is one you might like to keep because you've won some money with it, so it's paid for itself. Perhaps this one is one that should stay in the Great Southern. It was a little selfish of me to make that comment, really, when I stopped to think of it, because she was truly battling for finance. Anyway, as it so happened, a gentleman arrived in Albany who was offering good money for Aboriginal art, and he approached uh, Jeff Narkel, Bella's uh, son, and sure enough, the painting got sold, and it went over east. I was a little disappointed and Bella could see the disappointment in me and she said, well, well, one day I will do you one like that. A few weeks later, Jeff said to me, would you like to come in and have a look at some artwork that Mum's done? I knew who the commission was for the other. I looked at it and I said to Bella, I think they will be very, very happy with that, Bella. And I was looking at the four of the other size and there was this one particular big one sitting there with outline done and Bella said to me, um, do you like the outline of that one? And I said, I think it looks beautiful. And she said, well, I hope so, because that's the one I'm doing for you. And I was, I was just so taken aback that she would think enough to do not only the painting for me, but it happened to be the biggest of the five frames.